Ryan, match winner. You were on the pitch for a couple of minutes when Glenn back heels that ball through. You're one on one with the keeper. Just talk us through kind of what's going through your head in the finish. I think first of all, coming on, you just got to you got to think about how you can affect the game. Um, and, and you coming on on the left hand side, I can always be on my right, so it's you know it's more of an opportunity to finish. T vision from tails like to back heel it there and just know where I was at that time it was perfect. And I think you just got to get your first touch right there and then just bend it around keeper. Yeah. And describe that that feeling, that celebration. Um, obviously, you've already scored the season away, Kepram, but your first goal at the Brewfield in front of the fans for quite a while. Yeah, yeah, no, it was a great feeling, and I think I'm one of the the worst for probably a rubbish celebration when I score because that, that's just because I enjoy it so much, you know. Um, I do enjoy scoring, and it, there's no better feeling in football to be honest. You know, winning's good, but when you score yourself, it's it's a great feeling. And you spoke a little bit there, but what was the message from from the managers when you when you obviously came on? Just go and impact the game, you know. I think obviously Jude's had a good game, but you can see we're getting a bit tired towards the end of the game. He's got an assist, he had a great game, and just said, you know, get on the left hand side and try to affect the game, work hard. You know, it's first and foremost, I think every manager wants that, but these more than anyone want you to work hard. And, you know, I went on with the right attitude, which you should do. And um, you just got to stay positive and always look for a chance as a winger, you know, you need to try and impact the game. And, you know, that's what I did and won the game. And you speak about the managers want you to work hard. How have you found the new management team um, since they've came in in terms of the, the training sessions? How have you found them? And, and it's a, it does feel like a bit of a, a new era at the club. Obviously, you've been here a while and seen Jason and Tommy come and go. So it, it does feel like a, a completely new place, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. No, it's, I think it's refreshing. You know, two new guys, new ideas. And uh, they're very motivating. You know, they want us to work hard. All the training you know, really, really intense and hard working. And yeah, they're, they're good, you know, because they do... They're good at like giving us the information and then taking it. You know, they take it on the chin as well. If we lose, or we don't, you know, we don't put it on on the pitch. So, yeah, it's been good. And it's been refreshing because um, training's been good, and like the motivation from sidelines and before games, it's all good, and we get the correct information. And I suppose in the early stages of their of their kind of tenure here, it's it's a, each player's kind of playing for their place. It's almost a clean slate for everyone. So, is that in the back of your head? Yeah, hundred percent. Because I know I know they've liked me in the in the past. You know they have they've tried signing me before, so I knew when they were coming in, I was I was quite excited because I thought, well, if they want to sign me, I'm kind of, you know, if I you know play train well, play well, then they, you know they're going to want to pick me. And it was it was quite exciting when they were coming in, thinking, I, you know, I've got a, I've got a chance here. You know, train well, and you know what they do, they do if you train well, you're in. Um, I started two hundred in the first two games, and I probably won at it, like I was in the Chester game before they got in when Jay took charge. Um, and they, they switch you up. They're good. They, you know, they'll always give another, another player a chance. And you know, if you're not doing it, you know, you, you lose your spot, and someone else will come in, and it's their chance. But today, I just thought I wait for my wait for my chance. Came on, and yeah.